What you'll need, two to three yards of upholstery weight fabric. We're using Spoonflower's Dogwood Denim. Self-healing cutting mat, ruler, pencil, rotary blade, needle and thread, sewing machine. Begin by measuring all sides of the cube you would like to recover. I'm recovering a 15 inch by 15 inch six-sided square cube. I want to use a quarter inch seam allowance when sewing my pattern pieces together. I will need to add a quarter of an inch to all sides of my 15 inch by 15 inch pattern pieces. This means that my final pattern pieces should measure 15 and a half by 15 and a half inches. Once you've figured out the final measurements for each of your pattern pieces, cut out all pieces from your upholstery weight fabric. I cut out six fabric squares measuring 15 and a half by 15 and a half inches. With right sides together, take two of your fabric pattern pieces and stitch together with a quarter inch seam, leaving a quarter inch gap at the top and bottom of your stitch line. Repeat the above step until all four side pieces are sewn together in a consecutive line. With right sides facing, match up the raw edges of the cube top with the sewn cube sides. This is where the quarter inch gaps you left at the beginning and end of your stitch lines comes in handy. Once the sides and top are attached, you will need to close the last side seam of the cube. With right sides still facing, match up raw edges of the remaining side seams of the cube, pinching the corner of the cube top between the sides. Starting at the bottom of the cube side and leaving a quarter inch gap at the beginning of your stitch line, stitch into place. Sew all the way to the end of the stitch line as you will need to secure the top corner firmly to the sides. Flip your cover right side out and place the cube you are recovering inside. Lay the bottom of the cube cover over the bottom of the cube, matching up the raw edges of the bottom and sides as best as you can. Stitch the bottom to the sides with a blind hem stitch. You're finished.